All right, today we're gonna to be looking at lesson two using the find feature and find and replace. For this lesson, we're gonna start off by finding the page that mentions Caroline Gordon, and then we're gonna highlight her name. So we're gonna do that by clicking on the magnifying glass icon on the upper right hand side of the ribbon. And we will, it normally starts off with just the find tool selected, so it might look something like this. And we're gonna type in Caroline's name. Caroline Gordon. And it will select the name of the student. So right now it's showing it as highlighted, but it's not actually highlighted in the document. So we're gonna click in next to the name to get out of the find tool temporarily and then we're going to click in the middle ribbon rib, of the ribbon for the text formatting and change that to a yellow highlight so we can see where she is mentioned. We're going to go back to the find and replace tool for the second step and we're going to change it so by clicking on the gear button we can change it from the find button to the find and replace option. So now when we look for the name Elliot, we're going to search for Elliot with two L's and we're going to replace it with Elliot with one L. So same kind of process that we'll go through and highlight each place where Elliot's name pops up and each time we want to press this replace button on the upper right hand side of the screen. And you can see it will change that automatically for us. Now there is an option to replace all. You just want to be very careful using that uh, because with our next example with Alan, if you don't have it selected correctly, it will re replace the middle of word. So if I type in the word Alan, for example, and then skip through my document using the arrows on the upper right hand side, it might grab the middle of words. Oh, I think I changed the setting already. So you can select it to say whole words only, which is what I remember, recommend because in the beginning, if you don't have that selected, it will change. The, the name Alan is in the word balance. So it would replace the middle of a word and then you're compounding your issues. So we're gonna look for Alan with one L and replace it with Alan with two L's and an E. And I always just do replace single the replace one at a time just to make sure I don't make any mistakes. There you go. After you've done that, that is it for this lesson. You can go ahead and save and that's it.